The short-eared dog is one of the most elusive mammals in the Amazon basin. Visitors to the South American forests are much more likely to see a jaguar than they are to sight this solitary creature. I am your host, Romy Gassanino, and I'm a conservation scientist, writer, and photographer. Every week, we'll be introducing you to new animals caught on camera traps around the world. The short-eared dog can be found in the Amazon rainforest region of South America, in Peru, Bolivia, Brazil, Colombia, Ecuador, and possibly Venezuela. It lives in both lowland forest as well as in swamp forest, bamboo stands, and cloud forests. It prefers areas with little human disturbance. This unique creature has adapted to wetland habitats by developing partially webbed paws. The thin membrane between the dog's toes make them great swimmers. Labrador Retrievers are a great example of dogs with webbed paws. The dog has short limbs and its tail is large and bushy like one of a fox. Its fur ranges from dark to reddish gray. This wild dog is mainly a carnivore, with fish, insects and small mammals making up the majority of its diet. And like many dog species throughout the world, the short-eared dog does not form packs. Instead, it lives a solitary life. Males only pair up with females during the breeding season. Females of this species are about one-third larger than males. This type of sexual dimorphism happens most commonly in some fish, amphibians, reptiles and birds. The short-eared dog is currently considered near-threatened. Their main threat is the destruction of their habitat and human hunting. Feral dogs also pose a prominent threat as they facilitate the spread of disease such as canine distemper and rabies. As elusive as they are, jaguars and boas can still hunt them. It's also been discovered that short-eared dogs depend a lot on giant armadillos for its burrows. When the armadillo has finished doing the hard work of digging its hide, the dogs take over and burrow in them. Next week, we'll be meeting one of the largest living terrestrial members of the order Carnivora. Tell us in the comments if you know what animal it is. See you next week.